Welcome to Chitre province of Herrera in Panama. This is our road uh, tour, motor tour through the city of Chitre. Starting here at a brand new mall, just opened as you can see Subway, McDonald's, a great grocery store called The Ray, and a big pharmacy called The Rocha. Mall is not full yet. It just opened uh, maybe four or five months ago, and it's filling up quickly. Uh, coming into the one of the main roads in the Bay, uh, we are are going to uh, pass the movie theater, some restaurants, uh, and up, up here is the. Uh, police station on the right coming up. You can see there are many more cars in the city of Chitre. Approximately 40 to 45,000 people live here. Uh, not many Americans or foreigners, just a few Canadians. Mostly, uh, I would say probably about 50 to 60 Americans and Canadians live here. You can pretty much go all day long and not see any foreigners at all. And again, as in our other videos, we will tell you that virtually no one speaks English here. Regardless of what you've heard on TV, magazines, movies, English is not the big language here. On the left, you'll see a great place for ice cream, banana splits, and sundaes. Used to be an old Dairy Queen, now called Frosty's. Very good place. Memories Restaurant, an excellent, fantastic restaurant on the second floor. There in that same building is also a first-run movie theater in Spanish and English. On the right is the Grand Asuero Hotel and the Avis Rent-A-Car, in case you need a car. The Grand Asuero is an excellent hotel, clean, beautiful rooms, reasonably priced, plenty of parking. Coming up to the Hotel Versailles, another excellent hotel. Both have beautiful swimming pools, uh, excellent rates, especially during low season, which is in the United States winter time. Um, there's a local coaster bus that just passed. You'll find them running everywhere, all over today and all over Panama. Um, now we're coming into the shopping district of Chitre. In front of us, the big building on the left is a Banco Nacional, one of the biggest banks here in Chitre. You'll see many cars, and in just a minute or so, you're going to see many people. Christmas time here in about another nine or ten days so many people are here shopping uh, you would might wonder where the recession is down here in Panama kind of doesn't exist we never were hit with anything the Panamanian people have money and they're spending it. over to the right you'll see a grocery store called Pole Mart a big store that carries just about anything that you want from uh, meats, uh, to dairy products, fruits, vegetables, all of your canned goods, many American brands, and also artificial flowers, uh, domestics, electronics, they pretty much sell everything. Across the street is Casa Gala, a big electronic store, mostly televisions, um, very good prices down here, now, comparable to the United States. Uh, you'll find groceries comparable also. You don't really save a lot of money down here buying groceries as opposed to the United States. But what you will find um, is buying Panamanian brands. Uh, you'll find you, you'll cut your grocery bill probably by a half to two thirds. Uh, Panamanians are very fond of rice and beans and chicken. Right now, chicken is running $1.30 a pound. Uh, their, their carne, or what we call our beef, runs anywhere from $1.50 to $3 a pound.
but you will find that it is not anything even comparable to USDA beef. Uh, so if you come here and you want a good steak, down here in Chipre, Panama, uh, and uh, Las Tablas and Tennessee, you are not going to find American meat. Okay, continuing on our store, on our tour of downtown, you can see it's four lanes to town. Pretty much on this street, you can buy anything you want from restaurant supplies, clothes, shoes, food, cars. There are four or five car dealers here in town. Uh, they have video rentals, pharmacies, um, and more grocery stores. Coming up on the left is a place called Electra. Great place to buy televisions, refrigerators, uh, electric uh, appliances, washers, dryers, and now Machitazo, a giant grocery store uh, with the hair salon, restaurants, uh, and just about anything you want as far as clothes, shoes. Uh, in other words, you can buy anything you want at Machitazo. There's some local street vendors. They're in every town all over Panama mostly selling trinkets and uh, uh, lottery tickets and just about anything else you can think of. In front of us is a coaster bus. They'll stop anywhere you want to get on or off. Cost about 25 cents to ride all the way across town on this bus in front of us. It's pretty cheap. Uh, and it goes out to a town called La Arena, which is five or six miles out of town, and drives all around Chief Ray. Coming up is a truck selling pineapples and vegetables on the left. Coming up, you'll see Payless Shoes on the right. Across the street, you will see Macro. Great place to buy shoes, clothes, and uh, furniture. The discounts are pretty heavy there, and the uh, quality is so-so, uh, but not bad. Uh, on the right is a museum, all about Herrera and Chief Bay. Coming up on the right, next to the museum, you'll see one of the many parks in Chief Bay. Central Park, more shopping, restaurants, Lowe's stores, Citibank. So if you're looking for a U.S. bank with an office here in Panama, here it is, right downtown. As you'll see, many of the stores bring their wares outside into the street. Uh, pretty lively place, lots of music, uh, lots of people shopping. More vendors selling everything from lottery tickets to vegetables. As you can see, people here uh, just park wherever they want. Doesn't matter to them. They park in the street and block the road. Doesn't seem to make much difference. Parking again, as well as in Las Tablas, here in Chitre is a premium. Difficult to park, find a place to park, you might as well grab it. If you don't have a car, walking around the city is very easy to do. You can walk around, uh, spend the day, uh, especially now that the dry season is here, our summer season down here starting around the middle of December, running till April or May. And you'll find easy to walk. It's a little warm, but quite a few of the restaurants and stores here are air conditioned. Uh, however, many of them are not. So be prepared to eat in open air restaurants and shop in stores that are not air conditioned. Uh, right in front of us coming up is the main Catholic church here in Chipe. Uh, lit up very beautifully at night. Inside is also beautiful. However, if you've been to Europe and, and Italy and some other places uh, where the churches are much older, they're much more elaborate than here. But uh, still, this is one of the uh, landmarks here in Chitre, a beautiful Catholic church. As you can see, they like to beep their horns, or as you can hear, they like to beep their horns here like they do everywhere else in Panama. 
Panamanian people love noise. Firecrackers, horns, uh, music turned up as loud as it will go. Uh, as you can see what I mean, they love to beep their horns. Uh, they have Panamanians are generally a peaceful, calm, polite people, except when you put them behind the wheel of a car. Then you can expect that they become one of the most impatient people on planet Earth. Uh, it looks like we've got something going on here. The police are making us turn here for some reason. As you can see, the police, they dress up. Look at this guy carrying a shotgun. They dress up in paramilitary type uniforms and uh, absolutely intimidate the local population. But uh, they're pretty respectful to foreigners, especially Americans and Canadians. Here is another beautiful park in Chitre. Uh, beautiful at night when it's lit up. There are many flowers. It's well maintained. We just passed on the right another hotel called the Hotel Rex. Very good place to stay. Uh, reasonable rates with a good, very good restaurant. And uh, of course you have air conditioned rooms and cable TV and, and uh, all most of the amenities you might expect. Now we're going to proceed on out of the downtown area and uh, coming up to one of the two large casinos here in Chitre. This is the Fantastic Casino. Video games, a pretty decent restaurant, and probably 200 slot machines. Um, no live poker, however. Uh, we're going to go out of the downtown area. Uh, I might use this opportunity to tell you about our website at www.newlifeinpanama.com and uh, uh, you will find much more information, especially about the Domino's right across the street, which tastes exactly like it does in the United States. Uh, you will find information and reviews on hotels, on restaurants, uh, and um, included will be maps, which you can download from our website at newlifeinpanama.com.